everybody, and welcome back to more Dragon Ball Z Budokai Tenkaichi 2. Last time we finished up Zarbon's little saga, which was pretty interesting and uh, told you the, the treachery of being beautiful. This time we're going to go into a mission called Cooler's Revenge, which I can only imagine is going to involve Frieza's brother, Cooler. And we got Super Saiyan Goku on the front. We're going to skip this because I turn, it turns out... All of those spoil the entire plot, which they're going to show in cutscenes anyway, so I'd rather just show the cutscenes over that. Alright, base Goku, let's go over here and go to the mountain road. I like the mountain road. It's kind of a fun place to fight. Not the best place. Cell, Cell Games is my favorite, but it's still a good place to fight. Alright, so what's going on? More than 20 years ago, as Frieza destroyed the planet Vegeta, his older brother Cooler stood by and watched as a lone Saiyan space pod escaped towards Earth. Years later, when he learned that this same Saiyan was responsible for his brother's defeat, uh -oh. Cooler vowed revenge and launched an immediate assault on the Earth. And there's Cooler's right-hand man, Goku. Salza. Get away from Gohan! So you're the one who defeats Frieza? The elite soldiers of Cooler's armored squadron attacked without mercy. All right, Salza, let's see how you do. Krillin's alive, but apparently he wasn't in the cutscene. Salza is a pretty good enemy. I'm glad they put him in the game. He has an interesting moveset. Um, I wouldn't use him in an actual fight, like in a competitive fight, but still a cool character. He's better in BT3, as all characters usually are, except for, like, Bardock. But, uh, you know, you gotta like him. And he's French, so you gotta like that, too. But first things first, let's kick his ass. At least he's not like the last people we've been fighting that have the huge health bars. He has a, at least a normal sized health bar. I guess normal for story mode purposes. Kaioken. Kaioken, I don't know. If I get Kaioken, Kaioken wrong all the time, you gotta get used to it, guys. I'm not gonna change. It's impossible. I've been saying it one way my whole life. Full power energy wave. Ah, you lose. I dodged you. I'm starting to dodge a second ahead of time because it turns out my recording equipment gives me, it gives me a, like... I'd say half a second of lag, so it's helpful. It's helpful to know that what what I need to do. Ooh, nice dodge. Now you're gonna get your ass. Okay, how the hell are you still dodging me? Whatever. Come here. Oh, we both missed. There we go. There we go. Ah, oh, damn it! The wall protected you. No, why does that only cost two? Holy crap! It does twelve thousand damage. Okay, so you have a power boost on you. Well, you are, like, level 100, so that makes sense. Yeah, right. Let's first things first. Let's get some combos. Aw, oh, you ruined my combo. All right, let's get some combos going. One in the gut. Sweep the leg. Upwards. Aw, oh, I missed him. How? I'm so used to doing that combo. How do I miss? You know what? Let's just do this. Full power Kamehameha. Ooh, his scatter finger beam isn't stronger than our Kamehameha. Thank God. Had he done energy wave, we would have, like, pretty much died there. Oh, he got a, He has to recharge. I'm going to take advantage of this with Kyle Ken attack. Oh, man. I might be able to get a kill. Because if he has that much time to recharge, I can knock him back into the air and start another combo. Or not. He's too short. <laughs> All right, come on. Oh, I just ran out. The Kyle Ken just ran out. No. Curlin, help me. He has no health, but help me. Take this. And this. And this. Oh, nope. Alright, there we go. Goodbye, Salza. How dare you get in freaking Goku's way. And take Goku's... Ca Why is everyone stealing Gohan? Every episode, I just see Gohan getting captured. Let's see. Did it, happen it happened in the Raditz story. It happened in the Saiyan Saga. It happened in the Frieza Saga. Oh, no, wait. Did it happen in the Frieza Saga? You know what? It might not have happened in the Frieza Saga. But I know it happened in the other movie sagas. Having backed Goku into a corner, the armored squadron moved in for the kill when Cooler himself suddenly appeared. Ooh. Frieza! Gohan, stay away! All Saiyans must die. Good to know. Sacrificing his body to save Gohan, Goku took a direct hit from Cooler's attack and was lost from view in the fiery blast. With Goku safely hidden for the moment, Gohan snuck out in search of a sensu beam to heal his father's wound. Unfortunately, at that time, Salza was out on a reconnaissance mission. Uh-oh. 
Does that mean Gohan's gonna have to fight Salza? Because Gohan's probably not gonna be able to beat Salza. I mean, Salza already captured him once in the cutscene, so I'm gonna guess one more time isn't gonna be a big problem. Oh wait, but then there's Piccolo! Piccolo, go save Gohan, please! Like you always do in every movie slash saga that happens. Piccolo's always there to save the day. Go, Gohan's real daddy. And with Uncle Raditz dead because he sacrificed himself in a kamikaze attack, it's all up to him. Yo, from Namek? Go on, take care of the sensu bean. Thank you, Piccolo. All right. It seems you have some skill. So Piccolo's gonna take on Salza now. Um, I feel like I'll be okay. Piccolo's a pretty freaking strong fighter. Hell, I think he's given me my most defeats so far. Was just against Piccolo. So, whoa, no, wait, Bardock. Bardock got, it gave me the most defeats. Yeah, you know what, Piccolo, you're, you're second place, as usual. Or third, depending on what season we're on. First things first, though, let's kill this freaking Frenchman. Come on, you bastard. Take this! Cherry bullet. Ah, damn it. I didn't set my attack quick enough. Gotta get some combos in there. Cherry, cherry bullet. Come on, get back up here, you Frenchman. No, don't do that. That's boring. Wait, why didn't my body fly? Is my R2 button not working? Oh, it's working. I don't know why my character didn't fly. Special beam. Cannon! Oh, finish sign. Okay, that makes all of his moves stronger. His fighting and his freaking specials are a lot stronger now. It's just like Saiyan Soul. But if he dies, I guess it doesn't matter how strong his moves are. And he's dead. Never mind. Yeah, Piccolo's freaking strong, guys. Even in this series, right after... Yo, he's really strong, because right after the Frieza Saga is when he absorbed Nail. So, that's, that's a strong Piccolo right there. That's stronger than Frieza's second form. Or just as strong, at least. So, who are we fighting next? Oh, wait. An even match for Salza. Salza go after that brat. F Frieza. Oh, cooler one. Never mind, cooler one. We're in trouble. This is bad. Cooler defeated Piccolo in the second, which means he's gonna be—he's got to be stronger than Frieza, or at least as strong as Frieza. All right, Krillin, let's go. Hurry, get back to Dad. Dad needs the Senzu Bean. If that freaking Salza gets close, just use the solar flare. As you always do. As everyone knows, in the Team 4 Star Solar Flares, there are hidden images. You should look them up. They're pretty funny. So that's where you are. Crap, he found us. Oh no! He found us! No! Wait, I have to fight him with Kid Gohan and Krillin? I'm gonna die. Holy crap. You know what? No. If freaking Piccolo can do it, then Kid Gohan and Krillin can do it. I gotta believe in them. I gotta believe that they're not complete ass. Even if they probably are complete ass. But we'll see. We can do this, everybody. Alright, my health bar's kinda ass, but it'll be fine. Oh crap. That only costs two to do that move, and 12,000 damage. I really don't have 12,000 health to spare, so I can't, I can't be doing that. Go hit that mountain for a second. Go. Yeah, you can block it, but you're still getting shot in the face. There we go. Yeah, dash right into this. There we go. Perfect. Oh, crap. Alright, good. Missed. Good thing he's not doing full power energy wave when I do that move, because that move I would lose. Yes, Masenko did no damage. I should do the other move. Okay, I caught him. How did he block it? Oh, wait, I got into ultimate. I got into max power. No, I couldn't stop him. He keeps trying to spam me, which is what I was doing to him, so I guess I shouldn't be surprised, but still. Get this rush in your face. I said get this rush in your face. Hurry, Gohan. And Gohan lost his rush. Okay, whatever. I'm just going to charge it. There we go. 
This time I'll get him. I just won't have the power boost. So I'll do less damage. Is this going to do less damage than his freaking energy wave? Because I'm going to feel bad if it does. His does 12,000? Yeah, it does a lot less. God damn it. God damn it, Gohan. Get stronger. I mean, that move almost did as much as your ultimate. Nope. Aha, I stopped your grapple. Now die. Yeah, we win. I mean, Krillin would have won the battle anyway, but still, we won. Without even losing Gohan. But if I were a betting man, in the cutscene, I'm going to lose, aren't I? All that armor cavalry thing, I'm pretty sure if I put that on, I can get Sal I can unlock Salza. I don't want to because I already have a memory card with all the characters on them, but still. If I was going to do it. Oh, nope, I lost in the cutscene. Yep, that happens. Time to clean up the rest of the trash. Hmm? Uh-oh, enormous power level. Did Goku somehow get the Senzu Beam without us looking? Did they, did they not animate that scene? Because an enormous power level is pretty scary when you think about it. Oh, it's Goku. Holy crap. Salsa, run. Goku will snap your neck. Even though he's, like, not a killer, he'll snap your neck. Holy shit. You bothered... This has gone far enough. Leave Earth now while you still can. So, you finally showed yourself safe. Oh, cooler. You're back. Go. Let me see the power of a Super Saiyan. You really want to test me? All right, Cooler is working with Salza. We're going to be... Oh, God, we're actually fighting them. Holy crap. Cooler and Salza? Cooler is, doesn't even need his minions? That's like if I had to fight Frieza and Zarbon. That makes no sense. You just need Frieza to beat Goku. You don't need Frieza and Zarbon. Eh, whatever. Cooler's smart. He called in backup. I guess I can respect that. Get some combos going. There we go. Get up, you Frenchman. Come here. There we go. Nice block on your part. Let me stun you. Kamehame. Oh! That was everything I had. Okay, he has enough for full power energy way, so I gotta be careful. And slightly to the left. Kyle Ken. His thing just. Oh, he dodged. I was gonna say, his thing just ran out. I can do it go oh let me do this if i spare bomb cooler i won't even have to fight him i uh, tried to bait his attack out but of course he was too smart for me come on cooler get up don't drown on me you know what screw it i'm just gonna do spirit bomb to him yeah, I caught him, man. Blew up the... Oh, Goku destroyed the Earth again. He's Earth's mightiest defender, but you know what? He's also Earth's curse. Oh, this is going to be a good trip to the dragon. This is a good use of the dragon's time, rebuilding the Earth, because Goku's a freaking moron. Destroying it all the time. There we go. <laughs> I'm like, why aren't you dead? Salsa did about, what? That's 1,000 damage to me? That's nothing. Oh, crap. They block that, and there's 5,000. Showing me that Cooler's gonna be a problem. Which makes sense. I shouldn't have had to fight uh, Salza and him. Because Cooler's a problem all on his own. Alright, let's see what you got, Cooler. Oh, you just fell way down there, huh? Full power coming on my Oh, God, he just took it. Oh, he has a full power energy wave, too. Cool. Come on. Come on, me up. Wow, he took that one too. What the heck? Come on, Cooler, don't you know how to dodge? Oh, crap. Holy crap, 12,000 damage power and en energy wave. That's not good. Kao Ken! Kao Ken attack, come on. Let's do it. And I'm gonna knock you away from here so I can do even more damage. Now I'm in my strongest point. Let's see how he does against me. You know what? Just do it again. This time a stronger KO can attack. Yeah, I'm going to break your back. Just like how I broke your brothers. Oh, 
Oh, I missed. Damn it. Aha, I dodged you, but I took all my energy, so I can't be in my hidden form anymore. Go into the mountain. Oh, the freaking floor killed him. Hell yeah. All right, that was kind of cool. I like that. I like when the environment can get the kill. Breeze's brother, Cooler Soldier. Okay, so Cooler Soldier with the little armada thing will probably make Salza. Ugh. So that was Cooler, really? Even with his freaking Soldier Salza, that was not even a fight. Oh, apparently it was a fight. Huh. I see why you gave my brother so much trouble. Fortunately for me, I still have one more transformation to make. Oh, crap. What? He's not even at full power. So we gotta fight Cooler at full power now, because that wasn't Cooler full power. Jesus Christ. What are we gonna be fighting? Because Sal's is dead, apparently. Like, he's not even... In, he wasn't even in the cutscene. But freaking uh, Cooler here, he's, he's not done yet. You know what? He is a movie villain. They're supposed to be like these big old things. Like, Slug had the giant form. Uh, Can Goku consider yourself honored? Oh, boy. Are we gonna watch this? We gonna be able to see you transform? Nope, there it is. Okay, cooler final form. That's what we're fighting, people. That cooler is the most badass design for. Well, that's the only badass design for cooler. The other one looks a little like Frieza, so it makes sense. But this transformation is badass. And funny enough, one of my friends in BT3, one of like I think he was ranked fourth the last time we did a tournament. Um, he uses Cooler. Cooler's like his tank character, and oh my god, he has so much health in this game. Jesus Christ. Cooler's his tank character, so it's pretty- oh crap. I got all the way to 70! Holy crap, I'm getting better at this! I swear to god, I used to suck. I'm doing it, people, I'm doing it! Alright, Cooler, you're gonna die for this. But yeah, he uses Cooler as a tank character, and BT3 Cooler has four bars of health, which is really good. Only a few characters have that. Usually the tank characters or the giant characters have four bars. So, pretty good for him. Plus, he has good Death Chaser, which is a really good dash attack. And Death Beam, which is just a nice two-key two, uh, two, two attack where it only costs two bars. It's really good. So, Core is an over, overall pretty good character. I would say... I would say high tier. I wouldn't say he's a god tier level character, but I would say he's about a high tier, which is definitely way more, definitely usable. Come on, get that freaking Dragon Ball. I want it. I want the Dragon Ball. Let me get it. Oh my god, how do you keep getting these? How do you charge that so quickly? Can't you? Ah, you can't get me when I'm on the floor. Well, you are going to get... I'm going to die. All because I wanted that Dragon Ball, I'm going to die. Oh, you didn't. You messed it up. Oh, crap. I knew it. You were going for the same move. Oh, crap. He countered it. Okay, okay. I gotta use this wall I can because I'm about to die. You know what? This is a this is a good time. Krillin, you might want to get out of here because Goku's hurting. Normally, I wouldn't switch, but I don't want to lose. Plus, I might go for that Dragon Ball. And I don't mind sacrificing Krillin. Got it! Okay, cool. I didn't even see where it was and I got it. There we go. That's what I like to see. Crap, 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 crap. Nope. There we go. There we go. There we go. Bam! Freaking Krillin, man. Kamehame. Oh, he just dodged that. Kamehame. Yes! That chaser can't counter it. Oh crap. Wait, Death Chaser only costs two in this game? Oh yeah, I'm, I'm not winning that one. I started late. Aw, oh, damn it, I stopped my attack. This move looks so cool though. It's one of the reasons why my friend picks him. Look at that! Oh, The kick on the chest. It's one of the reasons why my friend picks this character. Help me, help me, help. Jesus Christ, stop doing that. gonna get him oh my key blast blasts off me when I have max power okay the destructo disc did it Krillin is the best 
And Goku at least lived. It would have sucked to have Goku die. But Goku lived, so good job, everybody. We got the three-star Dragon Ball. Heck yeah, we did, everybody. Cooler is no more. Everyone working together, friendship was the answer yet again. As promised, Cooler's ultimate form proved to be far more terrible than Frieza's. But even so, Goku refused to give up. Like his brother before him, Cooler underestimated Goku's resolve, a fact he came to realize only too late. Unable to withstand Goku's Super Saiyan powers, Cooler was overwhelmed by the blast. To be fair, I never won Super Saiyan. Annihilated. Guys, I did it. Good job, Goku. And so, peace was once again restored to the Earth, thanks to the Z Fighter. Yeah. We did it, everybody. We defeated the Almighty Cooler. But, is that it? Yeah. Next time on Dragon Ball Z Budokai Tenkaichi 2, we're going to be doing Cooler's... Oh no, the return of Cooler. Oh crap, so we killed him just for him to come right back. But that'll be for next time. I want to thank you all for watching. See you guys then.